Thank you so much, fellas. we got Roy Lopez, defensive lineman for the Houston Texans here. Good to see you as always. Texans taking on the Chargers, and we've heard, hey, got to finish better from Lovey Smith to the assistants to you guys as a player. What does that mean for you? How do you have to finish better, Roy? Right. You know, it comes down to the details and, and you know, doing your job and making sure that you do it for 60 minutes, all four quarters, if not a little more. You know, so um, it's going to take all of us, every single snap, you know, every play matters. So that's something that we've reflected on and, and we hope to grow on and we look to grow on and we will grow on. You know, yeah. it's going to take all four quarters, if not another one. So um, we're excited to get it done. So. Impressive stuff. Let's talk about the, the opponent you'll face. They've got two rookies that will be starting on this offensive line, which is a pretty darn good offensive line before you take those guys, those vet veterans out. But what do you make of that front that, that Los Angeles brings to town? Right. You know, they play physical. They're smart. They understand that they got a superstar quarterback, and uh, they have to get the job done. they got to protect them. You know, so I think they take pride in that. And, um, you know, they, they're very, they play as one. You know, so that's something that we got to do as a D-line also is we got to play as one to get the job done because we get paid to get after him. So. He one of the best quarterbacks you've ever seen? 100%. You know, you watch some of the throws he makes and you just you turn into appreciating the game. Hey, after two weeks on the road, how special is it for you as a defensive player getting back home in front of a loud crowd when you guys are out on the field in, in key situations? How vital is that? How valuable is that for you guys as a defense? Yeah, it's huge. Um, you know, third quarter of the Colts game, even fourth quarter, early fourth quarter, um, the crowd was crazy, yeah. you know, and, and it was nuts the whole game. Um, you know, just unfortunately we weren't able to pull that out and it ended up being a tie, but um, the the energy in that stadium was nothing like I experienced last year, you know, and it was it was awesome to, to see the growth of just the, the team, the organization, the city of, of just coming around us, and it makes – a huge difference, you know, just being able to confidence and you play with and the, the, the noise you hear, you know, messes with the offense. They got a full a few false starts yeah. that game and it all just bounces off of each other, you know. So when they say, you know, we need our fans, it's it's the truth. You know, we really do at this level. Great to hear, Roy. Good luck on Sunday. Can't wait to talk to you again. We really appreciate the time. Yes, sir, I appreciate you. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to know when we post new content.